to a do love experience youtube channel a interdenomination channel set to bring you more edifying content on faith marriage relationships and prayers and more from the fathers of faith that will help you grow and give you speed in your work with christ kindly subscribe to the youtube channel and click on the notification bell to be notified when we post new videos thank you hear me thank god for these great people that god has blessed me with but I remember the crowd that was in Jesus' ministry. They were the same people who said crucify him. So the larger they are, the more the voices that can say crucify you. You will need to cry for mercy. Cry for mercy. And say, Lord, not by our righteousness, but it is by your grace. The, the, the deliverance power of God comes in response to a cry for mercy. Apostle, right now I do not even know that this gentleman began to deteriorate and deplete until he who was once royalty with his father had now been reduced to feed with swine. Here's what he said. The Bible says he came to himself and he said, how many hired servants does my father have and I am here feeding with the swine. He said, I will arise and I will go to my father and I will say unto you, Father, I have sinned against you. You see brokenness there and against heaven. I am not worthy to be called your son. Take me as one of your slaves. Then the Bible says he got up and then he started going. Notice he never met the father at home because once you take the step, God will always meet you at the point of your obedience. It was as though the father was waiting for him to take that step and then he met him there are many people today who have experienced mighty deliverance from god 10 people can be in the same situation financially ministerially and a few of them will come out as if the devil does not exist because somewhere in that equation someone knew how to cry for mercy lord if you i know that i do not understand financial principles to fund this ministry with integrity but i cry that you are the god of heaven and because your mercies are new every morning show me mercy and that person who may not even know the dynamics of financial prosperity someone can and just call him and say God said I should give you a billion and you match the person with the results and they don't add up because mercy has spoken may someone be a beneficiary of the mercy of God in the name of Jesus Christ mercy a response to the cry for mercy when I go to God in prayer, praying for myself and this ministry, I've told you, I don't go to God like a man of God coming to meet a colleague in ministry. I go to him expressing, not out of a standpoint of condemnation, but the depth of my ignorance. Lord, I do not know so many things. You have granted me the grace to come this far. I pray that your mercy will be and remain at the corridors of my destiny because outside of your mercy this world is vicious outside of the mercy of god it takes mercy before favor arrives he said thou shall arise and have mercy upon zion for the time to favor her so the time for favor the first thing you look for is mercy first before the favor are we together yes the mercy of god There are many easy things that have become hard because we are still standing by our own strength. Trust in the Lord, Proverbs chapter 3 and verse 5. With all your heart, it says, and lean not unto your own understanding. It says, in all your ways, verse 6, acknowledge him and he shall direct your path. Verse 7 is a warning to men. Be not wise in your own eyes, it says, but fear the Lord and depart from evil father it is by your mercy i'll be able to raise this child not i know i will raise my child god forbid that my child becomes an armed robber you know how many sincere serious missionaries who invested in raising other people when it got to their own children everything you know to mentor a child properly they did and the child still became an armed robber how do you explain judas being mentored by jesus how do you explain satan as jesus's creation becoming satan 
are we together now you would think an excellent god should be so flawless in his creation and his all-knowing ability should have pre-informed him that somewhere along the economy of his creation there could be a possibility he would have programmed that in creating them yet a third of the angels fell and he still remains god yet satan his creation has become the arch enemy of his program and his purposes today judas the one who was responsible for the bag lost three things i've taught you he lost the money he lost his place his bishopric and he lost his life ladies and gentlemen i submit to you that it is by the mercy of god that we thrive and excel you are in ministry here you are in business i want you to know that you must perpetually walk in the consciousness that all we are and all that we have is by and large a product of god's mercy hallelujah i told you about a gentleman years ago this guy fasted that's the longest i've seen that i know he fasted for 400 days six to six 400 days i wrapped up the last day with him and after that guy wrapped it up he started suffering and now you are wondering i'm looking at my life and say ah if it is by the investment of spiritual things some of us should not be where we are but lord for your mercy you see the awareness of god the administration of god's mercy is what brings thanksgiving genuine thanksgiving where would i be if you left me now where would i be if you left me now where would i be if you left me now where would i be There are many of us, based on the kind of training you gave your children, your children should almost be, respectfully speaking, they should not attain unto the level they now have. But the mercy of God caused that when your children left you, God brought prophets and apostles to cover them. They served as midwives so that the adults you now have are not the children. The trajectory of your training should not produce those kind of champions. But the mercy of God the mercy of god some of you you saw idols eat up your family members and it's not like you were more spiritual one of the ones that died was even a pastor while you were an unbeliever but god meandered you through a crusade and here you are today standing where would i be if you left me now where would i be Mephibosheth, when you get to the palace, do not forget that you were that crippled young man at Lodebar. It took the mercy of God for David to bring you. So do not laugh at Ziba. Ziba had 15 sons and not one of them was favored. They were made to walk and serve Mephibosheth. He was a product of a wrong midwife. A midwife made a mistake at his birth and crippled him he would have remained like that but God showed him mercy Mephibosheth when they bring you to the palace I know you can act pious but when you stay a few weeks in the palace do not allow the memory of where you came from to be so eroded that you lose touch that was the mistake of Vashti she forgot that the only reason why she was queen was that she married a king not because she was a warrior over 127 provinces she only married a great man that's what made her a great woman and she now created a camp and an empire for herself outside of the influence of the king and she lost her place Esther was about to make the same mistake when Mordecai said don't make that mistake her man is about to annihilate the Jews and don't you sit there and act don't act. you were a village girl in Shushan don't forget the purpose for your attaining that glory 
hear me let me tell you ladies and gentlemen when doors open be ever conscious of the mercy of god do not allow the beauty of the palace to make you look down on others and forget that it was mercy that took you there man of god do not celebrate your ministry and go around sarcastic and being sarcastic and insult people shame on this one small church oh you have forgotten that it takes many years for a building to rise but in minutes that building can crumble listen carefully you have now become a multi-millionaire you have now become a billionaire and you look at everybody and they are like pieces of rag i'm reminding you that if you want to experience deliverance you must know how to call for mercy and live in the atmosphere of mercy my life today is a product of god's mercy look at me this is all of me there are some things that cannot be done by men except god assist a man nicodemus came to jesus in john 3 by night and said rabbi we know that thou art a man sent from god he said for no man can do these things except god be with him there are some results men cannot produce ladies and gentlemen and in the presence of this plenty the tendency is that we want to savour the glory and make it look as it as though it came as a product of our intelligence for as long as i am breathing i will let the world know it is true that he has helped us to pay our price in various places but i tell you it will be foolish of me to stand here and beat my chest to tell you everything you see is a reflection of intelligence no i'm the one you have shown mercy you have shown me mercy you have shown me mercy I'm the one say I'm the one You have shown mercy You have shown me mercy You have shown me mercy Say I'm the one I'm the one say I'm the one You have shown mercy You have shown me mercy Listen Years ago I went somewhere and I went to preach for a man of God and when I was done preaching I was headed to his office and I saw a gentleman who was working as part of the protocol he looked at me and I looked at him and I was in shock many years ago on campus that guy used to be a very strong person very vibrant and powerful if you saw that gentleman you would think he would explode in a global ministry within two years and here was this my dear brother didn't seem like the best of states seemed like someone who had been beaten by life and frustrated I was almost tempted to say what happened then I remembered man these guys were vibrant when I say you know what it means campus vibrancy is is, is with the infancy of spiritual work so you put your energy to it You look beyond me, oh. And poured your love. You look beyond me, oh. You look beyond me, oh. Sing, I'm the one, say. I'm the one. You have shown me mercy. You have shown me mercy. You have shown me mercy. Hear me. Hi guys, hope you enjoyed the video you just watched. Can you subscribe to the YouTube channel and click on the notification bell. See you on our next video. Thank you.